I'll cue you in maybe where you can chime in on this. Okay. okay. I'm going to share the stage with some fabulous musicians who I didn't know before now, but it's, it's my own fault because I can tell that they've been here forever. <laughs> sandwiched in between two amazing baritone voices so I feel like a kind of little lost little lost Welsh choir boy between these two because <laughs> their voices just fill the room. Yes we can and no we can it's right here. Oh yeah sorry gotcha. I know we can make it. Yes sorry I know we can make it. Oh, yes where is it? What's the final? I know that we can I feel a little intimidated being with these guys on stage, but I also, um, you know, when we get to talking about music and just doing our thing, then the, the love of what we do takes over. Yes, you can, I know we can, can, yes, we can. I think I'm going to take this one at the moment, it's a bit easier for me. Working in the coal mine and uh, Southern Nights were big songs for me when I was growing up, but I didn't know that Alan had written them back then. That was before my musical education. Well, I guess that was the beginning of my musical education. Those of us who write, things come all the time. We, we collect wishbones and feathers all the time and make chickens. Mm. You know. That's so true. Yes. I always call it putting a puzzle together. You're always getting little pieces, and then when it comes time to do a record, just start putting all those pieces together, and they, and it just happens. It yes. just comes. And I know that we can. I know that we can. I know that we can. I chose the songs because there were some stories behind them. I mean, obviously, we had a past where Nick and Rich used to write the lyrics together, <clears throat> and myself and Sean would write the music. And obviously, that all changed with Richie's disappearance. There are historical pinpoints in the stories you can tell about the music, but also I can actually speak on behalf of Richie a tiny bit, um, which I've got to be very careful with because I've got to make sure that I don't put words into his mouth. That's all right. That's all right. song, It's Raining, which I wrote for Irma Thomas many years ago. Never could imagine a man saying it. The one time I'll do it, one time, it'll be this time. This is a, a strange format for me. It is intimidating, but it's more exciting than anything else. I'm really looking forward to it. I feel a little nervous, but that's not a bad thing, you know? I feel nervous about singing Yes We Can and Can. Very, yeah. very, very nervous. But you're doing such an amazing job, so you shouldn't gone. be worried about it's it gone. at all. <laughs> I feel really, really good about this. Fresh music for me, for one thing. And it doesn't get any fresher than this, what's happening here. That's great, man. It's <laughs> a mouthful to get together. It is, yes. Well, oh, you're, yeah. like, you're, you're a torture. <laughs> <laughs> but a good one. It was a, it was a, it was a learning experience.